ready to go fishing? Yeah. Ready for fishing? Yeah. Hunter, say cheese. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to the Amity Angler. Got my family with me today, Murphy, Hunter and Ellie. We've come to Beachy Head Ledges. We're going to be bass fishing, hopefully, a bit of mackerel for Murphy as well. Now, you've got no chance of seeing it on the camera, but Ellie just said, oh, I've seen a fin, I've seen a fin. And there's a singular or one dolphin just behind us somewhere. You probably won't see it. Plan today is just have a bit of fun with the kids and Ellie. Catch a few bass. The bass mark itself, the ledges, really popular mark. Um, but there's 15 boats on it. I've just stopped about a mile short. Got the rod set up. Got the boat all organised, fenders away, etc. that are on the deck. Just so we're not getting up to the mark and then trying to sort stuff out. And there you are. Murphy's seen the dolphin. Murphy, have you seen the dolphin? Yeah. How many are there? One or two? One. Yeah, so we've got one, one dolphin with us. It's already a great day. Let's go see if we can get some fish to add to it. Well, this here is not my footage. It is Craig and Richard on their bass boat. Commercial bass friends of mine. They was at the same spot earlier on in the morning and dolphins were everywhere. So I've put that little bit of footage in because it's quite a nice bit of footage. But as you can see, it wasn't just one or two. There was a lot of them there. So dolphins, they're not feeding on nothing. They're there for a reason. Bait fish in the water, game on. All right, don't know how well you make this out. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven in the background, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 boats, including us. So the ledges are just there. It's basically an underwater cliff, basically. Uh, I've given us a big drift because we're joining the pack. I'm not going to go steaming amongst them. Um, so yeah, we're going to drift down to it. Nice big long drift. See what we can pick up. Yeah, fish on. Guys, we got a fish on. Hi. Alright, we got a fish on. Yeah. Can you run up high? I, I, I think I just got a bite. Hang on, man. Right, guys, we got a fish on. First drop on the ledges. We got a fish on. Come 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 on. I can't help you. Oh, it's a beauty. Whoa, that's massive. I can't help you. Oh, tension. Keep tension. Yep. We are not going to lose these. Yes. Two. Oh, I've got something. You put that there. You've got something wrong now. Oh, my God. Now Murphy's got something. Right, hang on, Ellie. <laughs> it's chaos. We've got two absolutely lovely bass. And my, and my son's got something as well. Okay, so here we go. So all we're doing is let the jig go down to the bottom, a couple of turns off because it is a bit snaggier in places, and then it's just a sharp up and a slow down like that. That's all we're doing. Okay, so welcome back guys. We've had three lovely bass now, four or five pound, I reckon easy. I will weigh a bigger one. Uh, but Murphy was feathering for a bit of fun. Had a bass on it and it swam into mine and yeah, it was chaos. Um, but there's, there's fish here and there's a lot of them. Always does kick off this time of year. Um, but yeah, slow jigs, sidewinder in pearl. Bang it. Murphy, you good? That's it, man, so like this. So one arm, that's it, they go down. And when that line goes tight again, down. Ah, you want that? Oh. You want? No? It's, 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 it's just a felt quite a hard pull. Well, look, you can see now. Yeah. See, it's starting to get rough here, look. Yeah. This is where we're coming into the mark. Yeah. So, if you're going to get a fish, it's going to be here. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So, keep going. 
You're in the zone now, guys. This is where you want to be working your lures hard. Murph, you've got to really jig it, Murph. This is where you're going to get one. Right, in the corner then. Jig it. Okay, happy? Yeah. Make sure you hold it tight, because if you get one, it'll go. Oh, God, I got one. Oh, God, Murphy's in. Come on, Murph, hold it. Hold it up. That's it, Murphy's in. Murphy's in. Go on, Murph. Did you there? Is it still there? Yeah, we're 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 Go on, Murph. Go on, Murph. All right, can you run up high? And I've really got a reel at the same time. You got a reel. Go on, Murph. Go on, Murph. That's it. Now you got. Now don't pull it like that. Just reel. Nice and slow, bud. You can, you can, you can. You're fine. Can you run up high? I told you this is what happens when you get big fish, Murph. This is big fish. Can you run up high? Murph, lift the rod. Now you can. You've got this. Keep it away from the propeller. Right, that's it. Now reel. That's it. Go on, Murph. Big bass. Go on, do it yourself. Oh, no! Do it yourself. Oh. There you go. Oh. Right, now bring it this way. Walk it this way. Walk it this way. Well done, Murph. This is your first. Look at this, Murph. Well done. And we're going to go in the net. Oh, yeah! Yay. Well done, Murphy! You got a go bass, on, man. Oh, he's just caught his first big bass. Okay, so Murphy's being net man for us. That first big fish was a bit much for him. Hunter is in the wheelhouse. There are those boys that nice fish over there. The commercial boys have grouped up really tight now. So basically what they're doing is they're narrowing down on the bass shoal. And there's, there's five or six close together, which we're really, we are the only pleasure boat amongst them, but I know them all, so they're, they're amicable with me. Uh, and yeah, it's good times. first get them, they want, they, they want to dive, just hold the rod, like don't, just don't yank against it, but then when you feel it goes slack, that's when you can just slack over my fish again. Hey, you lost another one. You get fish on? Big fish, Ooh. big fish. There we go, good yeah. fish. Oh, it's a good fish. That's taking line, this one. That might. It's another good fish on the slow jig. Murph, keep an eye on your rod, buddy, because if you get feathers on there, I'll keep working yours. Oh, this is a good fish. Murphy's got a fish as well. Murphy's got a fish as well. There you go. So this is on a slow jig. I think it's 90 under grams, something like that. Ellie's got a Ellie's got a white sidewinder. My little boy Murphy's got a bass on as well. He might even have me, because he got a lot of line out. Ellie, hold the okay, hold the one. Got it, right. That Yay! is that is another nice bass. It's chaos here because my little boy's crying and <laughs> I'm wrapped up in my boy's feathers. We're gonna stop that. I mean, yeah. There we go. I've got my little boy's feathers because he had too much line out. It's not his fault. Murphy, you half caught that. <laughs> All right. There we go. It's chaos. My little boy, bless him, he's scared of the fish. But that's another one. It came to the slow jig. It's just a little tiny, probably actually only a 60 gram jig, but that is a lovely bass. That's the best part of five, six pound again. It felt bigger because I'm bringing my little boy's Murphy's line in as well, but he's now going to fish with my rod. Yeah, look at that. Prime, prime bass, absolutely lovely. So I'll get this, get this, um, get this gutted off, or bled, sorry, because we're going to take this one home for dinner. And we'll go around again. You in? Ellie's in. Ellie's got one. Oh, go on, Ellie. Murphy's everybody in the net, mind the bucket. 
She's now beating me 5-3, I believe. <laughs> no, is it 4-3? 4-3. 5-3. Oh, 5-3. Actually, 6-3. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This okay. isn't good, is it? 5-3. Oh, of course. <laughs> You've taught me well. I have taught you well. You're right. That is 100% correct. <laughs> you hear that, everybody else? The fishes are me when they catch. I've taught them well. <laughs> well done. Are, are, are we going to fish now? You bet. Yeah. Doing better than us. <laughs> Wait, she's not fishing me. She, when you taught me well, I went, you can stay. <laughs> All right, that's the end of our day. Absolutely lovely bass today. Ellie outfished me today. I think it was five or six free in the end. Uh, Murphy caught a big fish as well. Him and Hunter in the wheelhouse is chilling out. Uh, that's the end of our day. I am back here tomorrow. Uh, not the best tide tomorrow, though. Catching the wrong side of it, but. Rocked up today, boom, first drop, two fish each. Biggest one's about six. I did hear one of my commercial mates say he had a double, so there is some bigger ones about. But, Ellie, you beat me. <laughs> Woo! Uh, never gonna live it down. But as she said earlier, I taught her well. Thanks for watching, have a great day, and I'll see you all again soon.